Welcome back to Angels Light to Row. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your monthly finance message for September 2022. And without further ado, we're going to get into your energies. Now, this is just a spot message. If you would like a one-to-one -one message just for you, feel free to reach out to me at angelslighttarot at gmail.com. All right, angels, let's get right into Virgo's, yeah, money energy for the month of September. What are the messages for you this month? These, ah, these last three are, yeah, we're going to discuss it, the energies that will be around you this month. All right. That not necessarily are you, but around you. Now let's take a peek at the major theme here. Ha, huh, okay. September, Virgo, two of diamonds and eight of diamonds. You are partnering up with someone with the two of diamonds. This could be a new job, you and a new job. You and maybe you're taking in a roommate. Maybe you're um, starting, uh, I, just, I just feel like you're coming together with something else, someone else, and it's bringing in a new opportunity, financial. Uh, you're, you're putting your money together. For some of you, maybe you're getting a roommate. Maybe you're doing Airbnb. Maybe you're... Um Maybe you're connecting with a bigger business that's going to help you along the way. But whatever it is, oh, it's a very powerful union here, okay? Now, let's take a peek at the recent past. You have the king, the king of diamonds and the ace of diamonds. So I feel like in the recent past, you had to make a, what do you call that, um, a... Ah, it's right there. You had to make a decision. <laughs> yes, you had to make a decision for to start something new. And I feel like you had to be pig-headed about this. You had to be cold and calculus about this because yeah, a managerial decision, something like that. I feel like um, you had to make a decision here. And it was, this decision was about something new, starting something new in your world financially. Maybe it had to do with moving to a new place that was financially putting you in a better situation. Maybe it was taking on a new job where you were elevated. And I feel you were elevated by uh, it's something. It's almost like a leveling up, but it was through doing something thing new okay now in the middle of the month that was in the recent past in the middle of the month we have the four yes 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 we have the four of diamonds with the five of diamonds so what I'm feeling here the four of diamonds is telling me that in the middle of the month there is financial stability there's a peace there's a calm about money and I feel like that is because um, for some of you because you have this calm this peace about money it's freeing you up to do other things if you need to travel if you need to go somewhere if you need to expand your business yeah if you whatever it is you need you have the ability to do it because you have this peace about you that your your um, security is locked in and it's there so therefore you can go ahead and do and go and be all the other things that you need to do okay so now that's that's a very pleasant pleasant experience now when we look at the end of the month we have the six of diamonds and the ten of diamonds here and what that is telling me is yeah your finances are still flowing here and I feel like it's flowing it's it's almost I, I just feel like it's get it's it's going it's going and it's just getting better it's almost like a snowball effect it's getting better maybe every month you're saving and you're compounding on that savings or maybe you're um, investing in a business and and that investment is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger you're feeling good at the end of September okay now when we look at your bonus here the seven of diamonds and the nine of diamonds I feel like there is um, some energy around you I feel like um, um, why do I feel like there's some blessings here? There's so many blessings. Like you're going to find yourself in a position this month then you have more than what you typically have. The nine of diamonds is telling me that you can... 
You can give away some time. You can give away some of the things that you do do. You can um, take a break, take a vacation, whatever it is. You can let go financially because you're sitting in a spot that you've never been before. And I'm just going to leave it like that. Now let's take a let's take a peek at the energies that are surrounding you this month. You have the Queen of Diamonds. That's what I figured with the Jack of Diamonds and the Three of Diamonds. So the energy around you, there is going to be so many shiny things that you're going to want to attach yourself to or purchase or invest in and things of that nature but I want you with the jack of diamonds to really think about this is this really something that you need is this someone seeing that you have so much abundance that they want to take some abundance from you and make you worry right so I'm gonna I'm gonna say yes you do have the money to play yes you do have the money to go on vacation and things of that nature but be mindful of this jack energy there's someone out there that wants to take away some of your abundance so be mindful of that this month okay um now this also could be some and, and this could come in the way of someone presenting an opportunity to you and that opportunity you know if it doesn't feel right if it doesn't pass the smell test okay if it doesn't pass the feelings test don't do it because you're going to feel like um somebody just jacked you I'm just gonna say it. like somebody just got over on you and now you're feeling worried because there's this energy of you just got played because they knew that you had it so I want you to kind of keep that uh, checkbook that debit that cash app that PayPal under lock this month because there is a feeling of yeah I'm just gonna leave it like that okay so I'm gonna leave that there I send you joy namaste and much much love sent your way